right. This is good. Here we go. I am. This, by the way, is a remote for the little camera. There we are. For the little GoPro camera that we're using. It's so great being able to just monitor what you're shooting. There we are. So what we've just done, put these speakers down. Look at this lovely cable. Nice fat cable. Feels very, very professional, very strong, the kind of thing that I get on your gear normally. Not the kind of thing you would get on a pair of multimedia speakers at all, so that's encouraging. Here we go. Let's take the power supply. That's the PSU there, the brick. And we're going to connect her up with this UK plug. Eventually I'm going to have to run this off a of battery. But before I work out exactly what battery system I need, obviously we have a, a huge big leisure battery right down there under the floor, a couple of hundred amp hours. But um, for the audio stuff we need, I think we have some special requirements and we're going to have to run 24 volts. I suspect the, the main system is 12. So I think the best bet is going to be a completely independent solar charged 24 volt system that will allow us independence for the audio system and of course we can always charge that from the little generator that we will carry as well this is 2.5 amps we'll, see. we'll measure it up and check it out 20 volts, 24 volts, 20 volts, 24 will be good, 20 will be fine too. Plug that in there. Nice comprehensive back panel, which I will show you in a little bit. Okay, now we normally have the computer running into those little speakers there. So we'll just use that. Let's pick up some, some, um, titles. Where's titles? Due to no internet connection. Right, well, there's no internet connection because this is my little modem here. We've just got to wait for that to come on board. See you in a minute. I'm going to have a sip of tea. Meanwhile, I'm going to clear out these little shelves here, which were designed especially for these little speakers. Actually they weren't, they were designed to take a pair of like car speakers, marine, like proper dual concentric things. But for many reasons, look at that, I have opted for these little guys. A whole bunch of reasons. I think they're going to be fine. We're going to get some bad resonance inside there. But they're front ported. We'll damp them down at the sides. It's all going to be fine. Okay. I'll tell you what, fellas. Yeah. Now you're not going to get even the foggiest clue about how this all sounds.
big moment is coming. Here is the necessary. The little cable that's going to connect the iLoud micro monitors in to my audio system, which is still very primitive. It's just uh, a computer and a monitor volume box. Anyway, here we go. They're giving us a fairly decent quality little vinyl plugs. Put them in. Turn the power on. Turn the volume to medium. And we're getting a good healthy complaining buzz. Which we will get. Oh, wow, the thing is loud. Right, and that is going to my little my little um I shouldn't do that, should I? The trouble is that power 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 connector is on the back. Power switch is on the back. Bad idea. Turn that. Turn that up. There we go, that's our main volume. Nano patch. M Pro Audio or whatever. Lost one of its little feet, so it wobbles. But it's a good thing. It's nice and quiet. It's just a passive volume control. Uh, uh, I don't use it in the studio. It was for a you know, B Studio or whatever. This is the B Studio now. So it is here. Um, and here's Pink. It's already sounding good. I listened to this. I listened to this track yesterday in the studio, very loud, with the, on the big, big monitors, it, and I said to my client who was in it at the time, I said, this is one of the best recorded vocal tracks that I've ever heard, um, just sounds absolutely fantastic, and the bass is enormous, and then that piano kicks in, it's just brilliant, so, um, this is going to be interesting, God bless America. Here we go. Well, they call them loud. This is, this is going to be loud. Oh, clear. Very nice, clear. Beautiful top end. I'm liking it already. Sure it is. So really, what's probably going to happen now is that I'm going to leave you and I'm just going to get sucked into this music, smoke something nice, uh, and uh, relax, and take it all in. See what we're going to have with us on the high seas. Ooh, yes. Kick me. Uh, taking the volume off. Woo! This is that. Good booty. There's only one word for it. Fuck me. This is good shit, man. Overall verdict? 